but he is. He's stepped up here. Hugo shoots right, puts it in. It's 1 0. Dean Macclesfield is to be taken by Lee Quinlan. He will take the first penalty for AFC Macclesfield, and he's already one down. Quinlan steps up, left footed to the right of the goalkeeper, and puts it past him. It's one all now. And Linotype Cheadle, AFC Matt, drawing one all after the first set of penalties. And he steps up, shoots, and he goes to the right. I missed the taker. That was uh, Cameron Manning. Uh, so it's 2-1 now to Linotype Cheadle. Be taken by the number six for AFC Macclesfield today, Jordan Lee, the captain. He will want to put this away. Jordan Lee steps up, left-footed, another left-footed taker. He takes the penalty. He puts it to the right of the goalkeeper. The goalkeeper almost saved that one, but it is two all now to, uh, well, it's a draw. So both sides currently even, and we are pushing here for a very close finish. Next up for Linotype Cheadle is the number five, I think, as it's shot. Oh, it hits the crossbar and eventually goes in. That was close, but it is now 3-2 to Linotype Shield. The next taker is top scorer Nathan Jackson. It is 3-2 here, and both sides are trying to win this trophy. AFC Macclesfield on the back foot. Lino 3-2 up. AFC Mac with their third penalty now. And it will be taken by Nathan Jackson who shoots. Puts it left. Hits the post. But it goes into the goal. 3 all here at Next up for Linotype Cheadle is number eight and the captain, Mike Wilde. He's going to step up here and he's going to try and put this past the goalkeeper. He steps up, left, and he's saved! AFC Macclesfield now have the upper hand as the penalty was saved by Elliot Simpson. It's currently 3 all, and this is the fourth penalty for AFC Macclesfield. To be if Naylor can score, this could all be over. Will he score? He puts the ball on the spot. Oh, actually, we have to find the ball first. There we go. We found the ball. It's now going to be put on the spot. Adds to the suspense. Lino are now down here if AFC Max score. It is Jack Naylor to take his penalty right-footed against Barry George. Will he put this in? He turns it left and it's saved by the goalkeeper who keeps it out. And Linotype Cheadle have now three. So it was the number five he took earlier, but it's the number three, Jack Taylor, who will take this penalty for Linotype Cheadle Heath Nomad. He squares up, he shoots and puts it, thunders it past the goalkeeper. It's 4-3 AFC Macclesfield. If they miss this penalty, the game is over. The pressure is on this taker. Noel steps up, shoots and puts it comfortably left past the goalkeeper. And we continue here into sudden death now as it's the number four, Jack Longworth, who will take the penalty for Linotype Cheadle. Steps up, takes, saved, but then it goes in. So it is now... 5-4 to Linotype Cheadle and all of the pressure is on Adam Griffin this time. It's Adam Griffin who will step up and take this penalty. If he Will he put this in? He steps up, shoots and puts it past the goalkeeper. It's 5-0 I think now and we're still going here in sudden death here at Townfield Lane. It's Linotype Cheadle to step up next to number 14. Andy Wild, who will step up and take this. And he steps up and it's saved by the goalkeeper. Now, AFC Macclesfield need a goal. If AFC Macclesfield score, they win this competition. We're going to find out whether AFC Macclesfield take home the Reserves Division Challenge trophy. He steps up, he shoots. And puts it past the goalkeeper, AFC Macclesfield are Reserve Division Challenge Cup champions after a thrilling penalty shootout. Miserations go to Linotype Cheadle who were superb throughout. 
but it's AFC Macclesfield in Reserves League 2. The underdogs coming into this game and they have taken home the trophy and will now be looking to move up and get promoted into Reserve Division 1 in their league form.